Welcome to Riverside Tai Chi. My name is Sifu Jesse Powell, coming to you from the heart of New York City. I got a book review today for you Tai Chi players, and uh, it's a great resource. It'll help you out in your practice. Take a look at it right here. <laughs> Classical Northern Wu style Tai Chi Chuan, The Fighting Art of the Manchurian Palace Guard by Sifu Tina Zhang and Sifu Frank Allen. Sifu Tina Zhang and Sifu Frank Allen wrote this book collectively. They're both located in the heart of New York City. And I must say, I've known both of these authors slash teachers for years. I've studied with both of them. I mention this for full transparency in this book review. I learned how to use my fighting techniques taught to me by Jan the Iron Man Lang when uh, Sifu Lang introduced me to Sifu Frank Allen back in the late 80s. Those experiences are too numerable to recount in this video, but I began to study with Sifu Tina Zhang prior to going to China in 2006 to train with Master Li Bing Si in Tai Chi and Master Liu Jing Ru in Bagua Zhang. This book Classical Northern Wu style Tai Chi Chuan, the fighting art of the Manchurian Palace Guard, is an awesome resource for Tai Chi practitioners in general, as well as Wu style Tai Chi practitioners. The first valuable resource this book provides is an admirable and fully detailed depiction of Wu style Tai Chi history. It begins with Chen style Tai Chi, developing into Yang style, and then progressing into the Wu style of Tai Chi Chuan. The book talks about the founder of Wu style Tai Chi, Wu Chuan Yo, and his son, Wu Jian Chuan, as well as the entire lineage, which includes Sifu Allen and Sifu Zhang as disciples of the eighth Duan Grandmaster Li Bing Si. The book contains pictures and detailed descriptions of all the moves of Northern Wu style Tai Chi and is a great resource for learning the form. The book also contains pictures and descriptions of the sword form and is an excellent resource for learning the sword form. The book also shows the basic stances done properly and correct hand positions for added detail and functional usage of the forms taught in the book. The biggest takeaway I got from this book is the internal thought process of internal fighting where the internal practitioner App applies clear, quote, be here now, thought, and moment-to-moment -moment decision making that never relies on subconscious reflex patterns. Speed is often replaced in emphasis by timing and positioning. These abilities of the internal arts are attained through the adherence to a set of principles that define a martial art as internal. These principles include internal posture, breathing, vision and mindset, movement, compression and expansion, and lengthening, and the harmony of opposites. These physical and mental attributes of Northern Wu style Tai Chi combine to give the system depth and create a formidable Kung Fu style that has stood the test of time. Again, I recommend this book as a valuable resource to any Tai Chi player's library. If you'd like to buy this book, click the link below and buy it from the Riverside Tai Chi bookstore. Full disclosure, I'm an Amazon associate and will get a small commission if you buy it from the Riverside Tai Chi bookstore. Otherwise, you can just buy the book anywhere you like. It's a great resource, it's well worth the money, and you'll be glad you picked it up. If you want to contact Sifu Allen and Sifu Zhang, I'll put a link to their website in the description below. That's it for now. Train smart, train well, talk to you soon.